I just shared a rather technical way to change the way that you walk, but now I want to share a really fun way, and that is to imitate other people's walks. So this is an art, and I am a master. I have been imitating people's walks my whole life, and I'm going to talk about this more in future videos, but I had the absolute honor of assisting Anna Devere Smith at NYU for seven years, and she is the master of imitating people. And uh, so I practiced imitating the movement of all kinds of people, and I have so much to say about that, and again, I'll talk about that in future videos. But for the purpose of this video, when you imitate how somebody else walks, not only do you gain tremendous empathy for them, uh, they may have pain in their body or they may be barely breathing or have tremendous tension, whatever it is, you gain empathy, but it will give you insight too for how you move because it will feel so different. So to do this, if you are walking down the street and someone is in front of you, start to come into the cadence of their walk. Every walk has a rhythm. You can almost sing it, like some are like, whatever it is, you can use rhythm. You can also notice the position of their feet. Are their feet turned out? Are their feet turned in? What's going on with their feet? Uh, you can notice uh, the center point, as we talked about, the third principle of the efficient body, the cent uh, moving from the center. Notice how is that center point moving in space? Is it, oh man, some people's center point goes so far side to side, or maybe the center point is bouncing. You know, the people who have um, really strong calves and they walk on the fronts of their feet, and they're kind of walking like that. And then their center point is going up and down and up and down. It's so cute. Uh, and then so just notice, start to feel, you can feel how are they holding in their upper body. And don't overthink it in a technical way. Just start to follow them and feel their walk. Whatever their walk is, start to feel that. And it's just incredible how much insight you can gain from that. I play Patonk, which is a French version of bocce ball, and I'm going to show you a couple of my favorite walks from Patonk League. <laughs> 